Do you know about the latest feature in Mac where you can simply add any particular widget over here on the desktop? Now, you don't need to go to widgets tab to access it. You can directly access it from desktop. This feature was not available earlier, but now it is. Now, how can you do that? I'm going to explain each and everything. But if you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Let's start the video. Now, to add widgets on your Mac desktop, all you need to do is you need to point your cursor towards the right hand side top corner. Click over there and you can access widgets tab. Select edit widgets and you get all the widgets option which are available over here. Now, on the left hand side, you get all the available options. You can check it out. Uh, for example, if I want to add reminder widget, so I'm going to select it and you get the options over here. If you want a small form, you can select it. If you want a medium size, you can select that and you do have a big size over here as well. So you can choose as per your requirement. I'm going to select this one. And after selecting, you can see first it goes to widget tab. Now, if I want to add it to desktop, I'm going to select it and I'm going to drag it over here like this. Now you can see if I close the widget tab, I can still access the reminder widget over here on the desktop. If I select it, it will open the reminder application. So this is how simple it is. You can again select it and you can keep it anywhere on the desktop wherever you want. So that's a good thing. Now one more thing. There is again a new feature in this one that you can add widgets which are already available on your iPhone as well. So select widgets, edit widgets and over here you can see these are the application which are available on my iPhone. Now, for example, if I want to add Spotify, I'm going to add it. It will come in widgets tab. I'm going to drag it to desktop. And if I want to open Spotify now, if I select this, it will show me open Spotify on your iPhone. So you can even access the widgets from your iPhone. So that is again a very good update in this one. If you want to move this widget back to widgets tab, you can just simply click and drag it and you can keep it in widgets tab if you don't want it on your desktop. If you want to remove it, right click on the widget and select remove widgets. Now, before ending this video, make sure that your Mac is updated to Mac OS Sonoma because this is a new feature which is available in Mac OS Sonoma. If you are using previous version Mac, then yeah, you won't be able to add any widget on your desktop because that option is not available. It is only available in Mac OS Sonoma. So make sure you have it. Now, that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. If you find this video informative, don't forget to subscribe. I will see you all in the next one. Thank you.